Southwest Dallas Hale coach Sean Hegarty in his first year. Sean, what do you anticipate being uh, one of your biggest challenges being a first year coach and with a new program? Well, I think the biggest challenges that I'm facing right now is the fact that a Division One program has a lot of student athletes and knowing the names and analyzing all the data to make sure that we have the best players out in the positions that they need to be to help the best help fit our program. Uh, so knowing all the names and, and watching all the video and uh, make sure that we have uh, all, the, all the pieces of the puzzle in the right spot. Who are some of the players or maybe a couple names that uh, of players that's, that you think are going to stand out after being, maybe flying under the radar a little bit for Hale last year? Well, I think, I think the first guy that comes to mind is Joey Nettlock at tight end. Last year he played center for us. Uh, he possesses a real big body that can move, and he'll be a matchup problem for uh, defenses. Um, I also think that uh, we have several running backs that are going to be a real force for us this year. Just Prezariki, I think, is going to be excellent for us. I think uh, Sean Bansburg is going to be excellent, Kevin Schmidt. And then we have a sophomore that's pushing all of them in uh, Zach Smith. The Greater Metro Conference provi or, uh, provided the, the two state finalists in the Division One Championship game last year. How do you feel your team stacks up against the rest of the conference coming into 2010? Well, the fortunate thing for us is that there's five new coaches coming into the conference as well. So from that standpoint, it's it's gonna, I think it's a pretty pretty wide open uh, wide open conference. Having said that, I think the three top teams are uh, Marquette, Menominee Falls, and Sussex. Uh, Marquette's Marquette. Uh, they're the defending state champion and conference champion. So you know they're the best right now. We're gonna have to, if we want to beat them. We want to be the best. We got to beat them. Uh, Menominee Falls is a phenomenal program, and obviously. Uh, Sussex with their coaching staff and returning a lot of their players are going to be very, very tough to beat as well. But all in all, I think that we'll be right in the mix. And I think, uh, I think as long as we do the little things, as long as our players believe in one another, as long as our players believe that each and every player is a championship player, and when we come together as a championship team, that on any given Friday we'll be uh, right there with every single team in this league.